Go sell them hat trick people. No doubt in my mind, he's one of the best under 21 strikers in the world of football right now. No more go sell them to Wolves. Now, only Man United, PSG, big boy teams that are willing to spell, spe spend, I'm just going so crazy, people. More than a hundred million for Gonçal Remsch. Guaranteed. That's the money that Darwin left Benfica. And how many hat-tricks does Darwin have in this World Cup? How many? Man, what a day to be Portuguese. And Gonçal Remsch, even in the league, has 14 goals this season, people. He gives guarantees there, too. Guarantees there, too. And this has to be said. Gonçal Remsch scored the first hat-trick in this World Cup 2022. It wasn't Messi, it wasn't Ronaldo, it was Gonçal Remsch. And you gotta respect the kid, man. You gotta respect the kid. Remember the name. He's even the first to score a hat-trick since Miroslav's left close in his first start. In his first start. And let's not forget, he had an assist to Gonçal Remsch. This is insane. This is insane. And look at the statue that Portugal managed to do. Pep, Pep became the second oldest ever, second to score in the knockout stages of the World Cup. Second, Pep is football heritage and one of the best center backs in the history of football. I managed to see Ricard Carvalho, now Pep, and Antonio Silva and Ruben Dias are now the future. You love to see him, man. We're so lucky. We're so lucky. Pep is 40 in February. I just want to say that, man. That's insane, too. And let's not forget Brun Fernandes. Offensively, defensively, he's everywhere. And the pressure that Portugal was doing against Switzerland, Brun Fernandes was key. And great decision with Otavio. Otavio played a great, great game. And the biggest shout-out, the biggest shout-out, it's a player that's showing up, showing to the world that he has to leave Atletico and join a big club. Imagine Jean Felix, the player we saw today with a Pep Guardiola. With a Pep Guardiola, with a Jurgen Klopp, even with an Ancelotti at Real Madrid. Two assists, and he was everywhere offensively for Portugal. This is a key world class player in the future for any team. And William at CDM, he played extremely well. Extremely well. He actually reminded me a kind of when he was at Sporting back in the day. Like, look at this team. Everyone's inspired. And shout out to Diogo Dalot that started. And Rafael Grey. You played well. You played well. I gotta say that. He played well. Wow. I gotta... Shout out to Rafael Grey. And I know people are gonna say, Mbappe's still better. Mbappe this. Mbappe might be the best player in this World Cup until now. I'll give you that. But the best striker is Gonçal Remsch. And the best performance, best performance in this World Cup was Portugal today, and we are ready to go to the final. We're absolutely ready. People. And I know Morocco only suffered one goal, and shout out to Amrabat, Akimi, Ziyech, key players, and Bono. Bono went bold in, in goal. I recognize that, but we are gonna go bolder. Bolder, we're gonna win the World Cup, people. I said it first, and I will, I will go bold. I will go bold if we win the World Cup. 100% guaranteed, man. Go sell Remsch. Bora, continue. And people, if you want to see more videos like this, reacting to Portugal, don't forget to like this video. And I said it. We are here to stay, and we are going to win the World Cup. We're going to win it.